Hello, everyone. English teacher Ernie here. I know for many Chinese people, picking an English name can be very difficult. While I can't tell you what name to pick, I can tell you three names you should avoid. These three names used to be acceptable names, but in recent years, the internet has turned them into insults. More specifically, they've become ways to negatively generalize a certain type of person. So let's start with our first name. Becky. This is often used as a nickname for women who go by the name Rebecca. A Becky is a slang term for a woman, usually white, who lives a privileged life. They are young and good looking, so they tend to get whatever they want in life without much effort. Because of this, they have a distorted sense of reality. Let's take a quick look at a comedic representation of this. On the house, Robin. Take this bagel on the house, on the paper on the house. I'd give you a house on the house if I could. You're so beautiful, everything in life should be free. Furthermore, a Becky is also a person who has lived such a sheltered life that she does not empathize with the struggles of others at all. Um, if you're homeless, just buy a house. Mm. Another part of the Becky insult is being basic. But when I say basic, I am using the slang version of the word, which characterizes someone or something as unoriginal, unexceptional, and mainstream. Here is what the dictionary says about this. Becky is also used to mock basic young women who love their pumpkin spice, Ugg boots, and social media photos. The key to this stereotype is that Beckys are basic, completely unoriginal, and mainstream. A visual representation of this would be the characters in the Mean Girls movie. Now, let's move on to our second name, Stacy. This name has quite a lot in common with Becky, but there is one key difference. With Stacy, there's a lot more focus on promiscuity. Let's take a quick look at the dictionary. Stacy is a pejorative slang term for a woman stereotyped as extremely good looking, but also vapid, vain, rude, and only interested in sex. You will only hear this slang online, and it's primarily used by young men who are said to have prejudiced views. They would say something like, back in high school, she was a total Stacy. Now, let's move on to our final name, Karen. I have talked about this name in the past, but it's worth mentioning again as this is the most widely used insult on the list. Karen has become a pejorative term in the United States and other English-speaking countries for any white woman who's thought to be acting inappropriately, rudely, or in an entitled manner, or demanding beyond the scope of what is considered appropriate or necessary. This is Karen. While Stacy and Becky are used for young women, Karen is primarily used for middle-aged women. But besides age, what separates a Karen from a Stacy and a Becky is a Karen tends to be more racist, closed-minded, and vocal about her ignorant beliefs. A Karen is also more aggressive and often feels she has the right to tell others what to do. Well, that's it for today's video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. If you want more English-related videos, make sure to subscribe to our channel.